Can you just introduce yourself and tell us a bit about you and what you do? Good day, my name is Johan Rubain and I'm the counsellor at the Outreach Foundation that's based here in Hilbra. I've been working for various organisations in Hilbra for the past 12, 13 years now. And my the key aspect around my job is mainly to work with the homeless community here in Hilbra. And Johan, can you tell us a little bit about um, um, your experiences over the last 13 years with Metro um, removing blankets from homeless people? Is this something that occurs regularly? What's, what's your encounters with that? The, the, this phenomena of the police, Metro police, bylaw um, institutions basically is every winter they will come around when NGOs, organizations, goes on the street and distribute blankets to the homeless community. They will basically come around and the following day just take it away and remove it, confiscate it from the homeless community. The effect of this at the end of the day is, is, is a community that gets cold, it's a community that is vulnerable, but it's also a community that's basically exposed to nature, uh, to, 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 to winter on, on the street. Yeah. Um, and um, why do you think Metro Police do this? So this? This has been happening for for as long as I know, as long as I can remember. And every year there's always an outcry to, to, the, to the government, to this community. Come on guys, you need to stop it. My honest opinion, I don't know. Um, there's, never an, there's never a good excuse of why they are doing it. And, but at the end of the day, you get a vulnerable community that's that's basically on the street getting cold during winter. Um, what would your message to Metro be about this? My, my message to Metro will be, number one, uh, let's talk, let's engage with this community. I think people are homeless because of various reasons. Um, and, and people are homeless because they are in need, because it's a problem. And that's why NGOs and organizations reach out to these communities. And I would like to encourage metropolis, uh, bylaw institutions to come and let's talk, let's engage, see how we can work together and support this community on the street. Thank you very much, Johan. Okay.